So the festival playlist has changed to winter. Winter is now here in Forza Horizon 4. And the cars you can win this week are the Hoonigan Fiesta if you complete 50% of this playlist. And the Ford Mustang 93 if you complete 80% of this playlist. For the Forza Thon, I've done a video for this already. I will put a link in the description down below. I also covered the Forzathon shop in that video, so go and check that video out if you want details on the Forzathon. The daily challenges, there's going to be one new daily challenge each day with them being called daily challenges. And they are pretty easy to do. A near miss is when you drive past a car as close as you can. And for an ultimate near miss, you need to be doing at least 200 miles an hour. And the best way of getting an ultimate near miss is going on to the motorway and driving the opposite way in a relatively fast car near missing all the cars that approach you. The ultimate near miss skills will pop in next to no time. For the crash landing skills, I've done a skills video on that, so please check out the crash landing skills video on my channel. Ultimate air skills, these are best done on the sand dunes near Bamburgh Castle. These are really easy to do in a pretty fast car. Wrecking ball skills, that is another one where I've done a video for it on the channel. Please go and check that out. Awesome air skill, you're doing ultimate air skills and awesome air skill is slightly less distance on that. So if you know how to do an ultimate air skill, you'll get an awesome air skill the same way. I've done a wrecking ball skill video on my channel. So if you know how to do a wrecking ball skill, you'll get those ultimate wreckage skills in next to no time as well. Just go and check that video out. There's a really easy way of doing these skills. For completing the trial, you win the Lancia Delta. And you have to do this cooperatively in a team of up to six players against unbeatable driver tars. The trial starts right here at Greendale Foothill Scramble and the car restrictions are B700 and you must use a Lancia manufacturer vehicle. And for this I have used the 1986 Delta S4 and I have created a tune called Winter Champ. The next car that you have the opportunity to win is the rare Honda Civic 84. All you need to do in this is win at the Winter Games Playground Games. And this is in teams of up to six against other players. So you're going to be playing against other players. But the Lancia Cup Trial and the Winter Games Playground Games aren't important if you're just wanting to do 80% of the Winter Playlist. The ones that are important are the PR Stunts and the Standard Seasonal Championships. Not only that, the Monthly Rivals and the Online Adventure. You only need to do these Monthly Rivals once and they will carry on through every single season for that month. This month arrival takes place at the Asmore Heritage Circuit and you need to complete a clean lap on this circuit using the Rimac C2. It's really easy, just focus on getting a clean lap. Don't worry too much about beating your rival because the game will actually find someone that's slower than you and you will automatically beat them as long as you get a decent time but just focus on getting a clean lap. It is really easy to do. As for the online adventure, you need to rank in the online adventure. So if you are unranked in the online adventures, you need to go and play until you get ranked. This can take anything from 10 to 15 minutes based on the players that you're actually playing with and based on the races the online adventure picks for you. It is quite easy to do and it is all based on the actual team that you are with. Just stick at it and you will rank pretty easily. Now for the PR stunts. For the northbound danger sign, you need to achieve a distance of over 725.1 feet. And the easiest way to actually see how to get these PR stunts done is to view the leaderboard. So press X to view the leaderboard. And this will bring up a list of all the cars used to get a decent speed. And as you can see here, some people have reached over 900 feet, which will smash that objective. Search for a relatively good tune. I've usually got tunes for every single one of those cars and you will easily achieve the distance. For the aerodrome speed trap, you need to achieve a speed of over 200 miles per hour. And as you can see there on the leaderboard, people have either used the Shelby Monaco KC or the Ferrari 599XX Evolution. The last PR stunt on the winter seasonal playlist is the Lakeshore Speed Zone. To complete the Lakeshore Speed Zone, you need to get an average speed of over 97 miles per hour. And one of the best cars to use for this is the Unigan RS200. If you don't have that one, there are tunes out there for the Ferrari 599XX Evolution and the Ford Capri and the Mercedes-Benz G65 that will easily smash this week's objective. By completing each one of the PR stunts, you will get yourself a super wheel spin for each. And now it's on to the championships. The first championship is the Winter Community Championship and you win a hard to find car. 
the Audi TT RS. Now, Tidy a Penny has sent me a message already. You cannot win the Audi TT RS by using the Audi TT RS. It needs to be a completely different car. And the car restrictions for the Winter Community Championship are you must use an A-Class car and it must be a modern sports car. The car that I'm going to use for this one is the 2015 Audi TTS Coupe. And to be honest, I don't think there's any real need to tune it. It's all-wheel drive anyway. It's already set up. Maybe take the tyres down to 26 just to add a little bit more grip. But that's about it for that championship. Win that against highly skilled driver tours. So you need to change the difficulty to highly skilled. It can be no lower than highly skilled. Win that championship against highly skilled driver tours and you will bag yourself the Audi TT RS. The next championship is called Bugging Out. This starts here at Glen Rannoch Trail. And the car restrictions are A-Class using an off-road buggy. For this one, I'm going to be using the 1969 Class 5 1600 Badger Bug. And I've created this tune called Bugging Out. For winning the Bugging Out Championship against highly skilled driver tours, you will bag yourself the ski hat. And the last winter championship is called White Knuckle Ride. It's a street scene championship and the car restrictions are A-Class using a retro muscle. For this championship, I'm going to be using the 1987 Fiber Trans Am GTA with this tune called White Knuckle. For winning this championship against highly skilled driver tours, you will bag yourself the new exclusive car, the AMC Rebel. So that one is well worth doing. So just to recap, complete the weekly forts are done, complete the daily challenges, complete the PR stunts, the seasonal championships, the monthly rivals, and rank in the online adventure, and you will bag yourself the Hoonigan Fiesta and the Ford Mustang 93. I will be doing individual PR stunt videos. I'm not going to stop doing those. If you would like me to do individual videos for the championships, let me know in the comments below. But that is it for this week's winter season. I hope you enjoyed this quick guide. If you did, then flog that like button like a pirate. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Every subscription goes towards helping feed the beagle. And so you don't miss out on any videos like this in the future, ring that bell. I'm Steve the Pirate. Thank you very much for watching. Have an awesome day. Have an awesome night. I look forward to seeing you all again real soon. Goodbye.